Hi there, it's me again, Yalavanya. We are continuing our discussion on Thiruvarut Payan, verse number 14. It's a lovely verse. Let's directly go into the verse. Kandavatrai nalum kanavil kalangi yidum thin thiralukku enno seyal Today's verse is actually a little bit fun-filled but at the same time a little bit pricky as well. If you look at it, Guru is asking a question. You are talking about your intelligence. You are intelligent. Yes, soul is intelligent. But you know what is your limitation. Do you know what level of intelligence you have? And for that he says, you know what? You are seeing something when you are awake, fully awake. When you are fully conscious, you are seeing something. But you are not scared of it. You are not worried about it. You are not bothered about it. It's just another, yet another thing. You are just looking at it. For example, we go to a snake park and we are visiting the snakes over there and we are looking at each and every breed, each and every variety of snakes or the species. Same ways, we are going to a zoo and we are looking at all the animals. It can be a wild animal, but we are looking at the wild animal very close. We have a very close encounter with the animals. But are we scared? Are we fearful? No. Imagine a situation. In a deep sleep, we get a dream of a wild animal or a snake. Imagine how much of a sweat we get during our, our sleep. It's only in a dream some more. But we don't even understand that it is a dream and we don't even understand that that is not reality. This is what our intelligence is limited with. And today's verse, Guru Guru is actually giving that information. He says, you know what? You call yourself as intelligent. You know what? You call yourself as the brilliant person in this world. But you know what? You are not fit to call yourself that way because you really can't differentiate what you're seeing in reality and what you're seeing in uh, the uh, the dream. This reminds me of the movie called as Matrix. I'm sure all of you would have watched that uh, movie matrix it's exactly the same you can't differentiate whether something is happening in dream or reality and that is what our limited intelligence is all about until we wake up we don't even realize that it is just a dream that's it with our conscious that's it with our intelligence but we yap around saying that wow i'm intelligent in this i know this i know that but having thought about it do we really know what our intelligence is about no When we don't know what is our intelligence, do we think that we have the capacity to analyze the supreme? Obviously, no. The answer is very clear. It's very, very clear. It's vivid. No, we can't. That is what today's song is indirectly telling us. Be aware of your limited intelligence. Don't yap around that you are the intelligent person in this universe. Such a lovely beautiful verse which tells us the reality this is the reality i know it hurts reality often hurts i know sometimes we always feel ignorance could be a bliss but not in this case so we need to appreciate that our intelligence is limited and we have to seek or we have to go and uh, look up for the almighty's intelligence because that is that is ever ev- everywhere it is a conscious which is spread across the universe across everything that we are seeing so we need to get ourselves submerged immersed in that particular intelligence that is what our wish our prayer and our effort must be spent on i'll come back again with the next verse very soon until then bye bye